Hello and welcome to MathAndSciencePower.com. My name is Joe and I'll be your host. Please remember that you can help me to help you by subscribing to my channel, commenting on the videos, and rating and sharing the videos with your friends. Also remember to visit us online for a complete listing of our videos. In Chapter 2, Section 3, we learned the product rule for differentiation, which says that the derivative of the product of two functions, in our case f of x and g of x, is equal to the derivative of the first factor times the second factor plus the first factor times the derivative of the second factor. So if this expression is the derivative of this expression, then this expression has to be the integral of this expression. So I'm going to rewrite this in integral notation. The integral of f prime of x times g of x plus f of x times g prime of x equals f of x times g of x. And again, the integral of this expression is equal to this expression. The integral of this expression is equal to this expression. And since the sum rule of integration says that integration across a sum is equal to the sum of the integrals, I'm going to rewrite this as the integral of f prime of x times g of x plus the integral of f of x times g prime of x equals f of x times g of x. Now I'm going to subtract the integral of f prime of x times g of x from both sides of this equation. And these will cancel. And I'm left with the integral of f of x times g prime of x equals f of x times g of x minus the integral of f prime of x times g of x. Now I'm going to make a substitution and say that u equals f of x and dv equals g prime of x. So that the derivative of u is equal to f prime of x and the integral of dv equals g of x. So I'm going to make these substitutions into this formula. u is f of x, so I get the integral of u, and g prime of x is dv, is equal to f of x, which is u, times g of x, which is v, minus the integral of f prime, which is du, and g of x, which is v and I'm going to switch the order here. So now we have the formula for integration by parts. We've now derived a way for taking the integral of a product or other complex function by rewriting it as a new expression with a hopefully simpler integral. On behalf of MathAndSciencePower.com, my name is Joe. Thanks for watching.